Nortelle's broadcast facility is located in Tournai, Belgium. We also have two offices in Mukong and At. We are a local TV station which focuses on local news, which is much appreciated by our viewers. We also produce features about regional events, political debates about issues of local interest, and a regular sports program. In addition, we cover local artists and cultural events. Notelle chose the IP because we, we thought it was a natural choice. Everybody needs to access everything from everywhere. For us, it was not uh, so expensive to migrate to the IP world. We had to remove uh, something about two tons of cable. You need good people which can help you to make the system working in the good condition. We started the project in June and two months later it was working. We did not test the system before going live because we had to dismantle the legacy wiring first and were quite simply unable to work in parallel. We installed the new IP equipment, which went smoothly. Any issues we encountered were swiftly resolved. I don't think anybody needs to be scared of IP. In Natele's case, I know that it will make it easy to scale our system by adding more devices as and when necessary. We also added the virtual studio manager system called VSM to our network. VSM is a very powerful system and we are currently only scratching the surface. The convenience of the Lavo and Clearcom solutions we chose is that, unlike competition products, they are very easy to connect and configure and that they require no bulky and expensive interfaces or gateways that would need to be configured as well. Our decision to select an open standard system allows us to work with any AES67 compliant solution. Additionally, our network is ready for future upgrades of our video equipment. So about the, the intercom system, we wanted to have a simple system which could be interconnected with the LAVO system in an easy way. The Clearcom Eclipse Matrix was a good choice. I must say that VSM is a tool we have grown very fond of. Users no longer need to patch signals manually. All you need to do is press a button to recall a whole bunch of settings for a variety of devices. Everything changes automatically. We chose the Lavo MC Square 36 all-in-one production console for a number of reasons. The most important being the ease with which resources can be shared. IP not only helps us to save time and money, but also provides high stability and security. I think that over the coming two years, we will also migrate our video equipment to IP, albeit in a hybrid configuration. At the moment, we are the first regional television to use IP for the audio system. But I think the others should do the jump into it because the financial part is not as tight as they think. There is a lot of regional television that asked us to come and see what we did, and they were surprised. Like many others, we initially thought that IP technology was only for major TV stations with a huge budget. After studying the market and the various options, however, we realized that this was a misconception. And thanks to Lavo's tight product integration and the convenience of having all-in-one, we have been able to make the jump. If I have to explain IP to my grandmother, I will say you plug one box, the other one, the third, and the last should be the mixing console, and that's all.